please subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. A humble start in 1996 with just a few commercial projects went on to pave the way for Unity Group to make a mark in the real estate sector today. With properties spread through the capital New Delhi, Unity Group has developed over 15 million square feet across 150 real estate projects in a bid to revamp Delhi's skyline. Its upcoming ambitious and ultra-premium residential project, the Emeralis at New Rothak Road, Karol Bagh, promises to be the perfect abode for affluent Delhiites right in the heart of the city. Situated just 3.4 kilometers from Connaught Place, 5.9 kilometers from India Gate, 4.9 kilometers from Rashtrapati Bhavan, 14.1 kilometers from the airport and just 3 kilometers from the New Delhi railway station. The location of the Emeralis gives it a sure shot winning edge. Delhi was always deprived of uh, you know, uh, a good development like this. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Delhiites only had options when it came to uh, uh, either going to the you know, NCR region, the Gurgaon, Noida or the other regions or uh, they were you know, looking at uh, something which was available from the DDS side. So uh, when this kind of opportunity came up to develop a 40 acre residential project, I think uh, you know, it, was, it was a no brainer and uh, the entire property is coming up in phases. Uh, we are developing this project in various phases. The Emeralis will have branded luxury towers within its 40-acre campus. Unity Group roped in global fashion design house Gianni Versace to develop its iconic twin towers that propose to be the tallest approved buildings of Delhi, standing at 182 meters and housing ground plus 46 stories. The 160 apartments of these towers will have interiors designed by Versace Home. Each apartment is 6,200 square feet, priced at 25,000 rupees per square foot, offering a range of unique amenities that embrace everything that Versace stands for. Superior quality, contemporary design and innovation through a combination of ultra-modern facilities. Versace in this project will uh, basically do all the designs so in terms of uh, our contribution to the project apart from producing the blending. We will design all the interiors, uh, we will uh, apply our DNA and our codes, our brand's codes to, uh, to the project. We will uh, uh, design for them a specific furnishing concept. So the idea that Versace has when doing this project abroad uh, in other countries to create really uh, some landmark project where, where the brand can be experienced at 360 degrees. So for example, if you think, uh, if you think about this project, is, uh, you are surrounded by the, world of, by the world of Versace. From the moment you step in the lobby, up to the moment in which you take your elevator and go to your apartment and sip your coffee from a Versace cup and sit on your couch and it's Versace. So the idea that, uh, that uh, Mr. Gianni Versace had at the beginning when he was thinking about this project, that Donatella Versace has, uh, has now, is that Versace is not just a way of dressing uh, but a way of living. With an investment of more than 3,000 crore rupees, the Amaralis offers a variety of 2, 3, 4 and 5 BHK luxury apartments with area ranging from 1250 to 6200 square feet. Some of the amenities include double height entrance lobbies in every tower, skywalk on the 20th floor connecting the towers, state-of-the-art clubhouse with temperature-controlled swimming pool, another Olympic-sized outdoor swimming pool, gymnasium, mini theatre, banquet halls, sports infrastructure, restaurants, cafeterias and what not. The perfect blend of convenience and luxury. First thing is that creating a
skyline for the buildings, which are going in a very curvilinear form. And then on the southwest axis, we place the highest tower of the building, which is nearly about 46 floors high and uh, on a very iconic uh, kind of a structure with a curvilinear shape in itself, so basically giving it a kind of a futuristic look. And even the top is designed in that fashion. Each tower has been designed in such a T-shaped, T-type uh, you know, typology, so that all flats have a view on both the sides. And I mean, the flats are nearly ventil through ventilated, through views are available for the urban landscape. I think the layout is fantastic. Uh, there, there is an alcove as soon as you enter, which becomes a little uh, private area in the public area when you enter, and uh, which is followed by the living room, the dining and the kitchen. So there is a very clear division between the public areas and the private areas of the apartment, uh, which really helped us to put it all together very well. Uh, the drawing room, the living room, dining and the kitchen is a gorgeous space with beautiful walls all around which can really be created into a luxurious living space and that's what we've done. We've we tried to enhance on all these beautiful walls that you know came to us. Muon shuttering technology is being used in the construction of the Amaryllis, which is not just speeding up the work but also ensuring better finishing of the structure. RCC or Reinforced Cement Concrete Flat Slab Structural System has been used for continuous clear height in each flat. Compared to conventional slabs, flat slabs are thicker and act as better noise barriers too. Minimum internal structural columns add to the large column-free internal space and lead to greater flexibility in layout for residents to customize their apartments as per their needs. Um. जो है एल्युमिनियम की शटरिंग यूज़ कर रहे हैं। अब मटेरियल वाइज अगर बात करें तो टेक्नोलॉजी और फिक्सिंग काम करने के लिए जो मेथड्स हैं, जो जो हमारे को इक्विपमेंट्स यूज़ करने होते हैं, डिफरेंट। हम लेटेस्ट इक्विपमेंट्स यूज़ करते हैं। We use the best brands here। उसके बाद जो भी हम उन ब्रांड्स को हम टेस्ट लेबोरेट 60-year-old Vinay Jain is a businessman from Sadar Bazaar. He has booked one of the premium flats on the 21st floor for his family. Jain believes that his investment in the project is worth every penny. I live in Pitampura. I was looking for the traffic and road. I was looking for a lot of time to get some place where I can get close to my business, where I can live well, where I can get all my common facilities, where I can get all my common facilities. तो मैं काफी दिन से ढूंढ रहा था तो फाइनली मैंने ये यूनिटी का प्रोजेक्ट मुझे मिला जिसके अंदर कि ये लोग बड़ी अच्छी क्वालिटी की और कंस्ट्रक्शन और जो मैं चाहता हूँ उस टाइप के फ्लैट्स वगैरह बना रहे हैं जो कि उम्मीद है कि जो मैं चाहता हूँ कि उनको पर खराब उतरेंगे और इनके साथ मैंने ये रहने के लिए दिल्ली का नंबर वन प्रोजेक्ट होगा। We have been dealing with Unity Group from past 15 years and we have bought almost seven to eight properties from them and their dealing process is really amazing how they explain and how they treat their customers. The Amaryllis by Unity Group is designed to give a variation in pricing across budgets depending upon the flat size and offers a total of 2,500 well-planned and perfectly designed units. The project claims to have more than 80% open area with construction in full swing. The Amaryllis' first phase will conclude by the end of 2019. The group is currently selling phase 1 and phase 2 of the project which have been duly sanctioned by RERA in Delhi. With a target to complete the entire project by 2022-23, the group will hand over more than 20 million square feet of developments in Delhi. As a family, we have been taught certain values and principles with which our first generations have been doing business and as the second generation, it's our responsibility and duty to take it forward with the same zeal and passion. Is Delhi ready for twin towers of super luxury, 46 floors high and of course with the branding of Versace? Let's find out from the man behind this project, Mr. Harsh Bansal. Mr. Bansal, thank you very much for speaking with CNBC TV 18. 
My first question, Delhiites don't like to go up very high. So why 46 floors, sir? First of all, thank you very much. Delhiites love to go to higher, floor, higher floors. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, they don't have. Whenever Delhiite people go to anywhere in the world, the Singapore, Dubai, they love to go to higher floors. They love to go to live there. They, they select the hotels, the higher floors. Unfortunately, there was nothing available in Delhi. And Central Delhi. In particular in Central Delhi. Mm -hmm. so we tried to encash this opportunity. Okay. So we selected this uh, piece of the project that we will go to the higher floors as per the requirement or as per the wish list of Delhi people. Delhi people, all right. So Delhiites better get used to uh, taking elevators right up to 46 floors. All right. I'm sure the topmost floor must be the most expensive, sir, being the penthouse. The topmost floor is the infinite swimming pool. Okay. Where while swimming, you can see the entire Lutian zone, entire central Delhi. Mm -hmm. Maybe while swimming, you can see the 15th August, you can say speech by our prime minister. Mm -hmm. And while swimming, you can see the Republic Day Parade. Wow. Okay. Those are those are things that Delhiites probably will look forward to. Tell me why Versace, because you have so many luxury brands to choose from today. Uh, why did you choose to, why did the Unity Group choose to tie up with Versace in particular? We, we were looking for the brand who don't, who don't have only the brand name, but they are, they have good team in the design also. Mm -hmm. So we uh, interiors we, basically interior, interior so design met, they probably we met have so many age. brands, but most of the brands are good in fashion, good in textile, good in perfumes, good in so many things, but they don't have full flesh team for the home for the mm -hmm. interior. Okay. For Sachi, they have full team. They are already in tiles. They are already in crockery. They are already in you can say textile. They are already in linen upholstery. So many things. So, so are they going to design the interiors or are they going to design the architecture of the project? No, of they, are these not, two twin towers? they are not going to design the architecture. They have given the inputs for the architecture also. Mm -hmm. But they are designing all the common areas, entrance lobbies, lift lobbies, pools, restaurants, spa, all the you can say common areas, amenities of the tower. All right. Yeah. How else would you uh, assure quality that you're promising uh, to the super luxury buyer, as you say, of Delhi? As I said earlier, the Versace is involved in all the amenities and uh, But beyond areas. Versace, sir, in mm -hmm. terms of delivery, because they say that high-rise projects take very long to deliver. What is your timeline of delivering these twin towers? Yeah, we have selected a very reputed construction company called Arabian Construction Company who is famous for high-rise building in Dubai and so many other parts of the world. So uh, this entire building will be completed by for structure in two and a half year. And uh, with all the facilities available, it will be ready in four years. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about Unity Group per se. I believe you've uh, already delivered about 10 million square feet, which includes commercial, retail, and also a little bit of residential. We started our journey in 1996. We have delivered already all more than 100 commercial buildings in Delhi. Mm -hmm. They all are existing, running successfully, giving happiness to the people. We have malls in the name of Unity One, one in Rohini, Janakpuri, East Delhi and one in NCR. Then we have uh, so many buildings in the name of Agarwal Tower and Plaza everywhere in the commercial centers in Delhi. Besides this, we have so many other verticals also. We are in uh, education, we are in automobile, we are in healthcare, we are in other segments also. All right. Um, I, I went through the press note and I believe that you call yourself a litigation free company and that seems to be the hallmark of the unity group. How do you, in, in the political capital of Delhi, how do you keep away from any sort of litigation, Mr. Pansal? I think that's, that's an important trick. Maybe our audience would like to know some answers. So that's our, our family, you can say, strength, family principles. We already believe in not fighting with anybody, though we have a law college. Hmm. But we never use our students for fighting people. <laughs> All right. And uh, we have uh, believe in simple transparency and uh, can say uh, solving the problem face to face. Or though we sometimes you have a problem with your client, but we, we give priority to sort out those problems one to one. That's why uh, we are still uh, litigation free, and we will try for the rest of the time also to be litigation free. Lots mm -hmm. of time is wasted. Lots of Energy is wasted in courts and everywhere and you know the 
courts are already very already overloaded so why overload them a why little bit them more? in terms of yeah, the deadlines that you've been committing to your customer no. uh, what has been the track record and please give me an honest answer yeah, yeah. here we have 100 buildings in delhi hmm. this, uh, nowadays rera is there but at that time when we started this business in 1996 there was no rera and we set the sum of the principles which rera is following now hmm. like at that time also we were selling the you can say shops or offices in carpet area only and on the on the total price the all the price was you can say transparent and inclusive everything and we never diverted any diverted any fund from one project to other project and you will appreciate that these all are the aspects rera is following now mm. rera is asking developer to follow these rules but luckily as a, as a family value we adopted these values in the year of 1996 itself all right so let's come back to the project the amaryllis which uh, within which these versace twin towers are uh, located uh, this is what a 40 acre it's, it's a 40 acre land parcel yeah. is it a joint development and uh, when did you get this land it's i believe near new rothak road ah, it's it's in central delhi it's mm. on the main new rothak road earlier there was residential colony by dcm group here dcm okay. delhi cloth mill was uh, the workers was residing here we had a joint venture with the owners of tcm and the land is a freehold land it, it was owned by them we had a joint venture with them uh, then we are developing them since uh, now 2013 or 14 and already under construction all the approvals are already in hand and construction is going on in a good pace mm -hmm. what is the pricing now let's talk about uh, the amaryllis and then the versace twin projects mm. uh, how different is the pricing and how different are the specifications our premium housing are also bespoke housing you can design your home as per your requirement it's a first of its kind in delhi mm -hmm. and the pricing are just to start with we are targeting around 15000 rupees a square feet okay which is a very reasonable price in terms of you can say delhi market I would say quite reasonable. Quite reasonable. I, is it is it because you find the market a little bit soft right now? Because you know, if you are promising all those specs, fifteen thousand seems a pretty pretty yeah. modest price. Yeah, it's, it's, thank you very much. It's really modest. It's two, of two reason. One, the project is big. We are just want to start with a modest price. Hmm. Secondly, uh, we are now twenty two decades old company. We want to establish something landmark in Delhi. so it's for our next generation that something should be settled something should be created for a landmark and then we can they can and cash this in in, the, in their future hmm i think i think we can wrap out here because you've spoken about a creating legacy and a landmark and i think that's uh, that's the most important part uh, we are wishing that there are more home grown developers who are able to do that because you you know sir how the industry is struggling to regain trust isn't it Yeah, you are right. But there are still good people. I will not say that every all industry is not good. There are people who are doing good good work every in all field. And uh, Delhi, it's a it's a lot of lot of new development has to come. And we all wish that Delhi should have good luxury or maybe premium housing in Delhi. We are missing a lot. We are missing premium luxury housing yeah. a lot, Mr. Bansal. Thank you very much uh, for speaking with us. Thank you, Mr. All the very best Thank for your project. Much. Thank you.